every mm-hmm. everybody needs to take a, a, a take notes out of Drake's book. You never seen that dude recorded on a video with sleep with like this dude had like some of y'all we didn't know about his baby, this baby that he'd been hiding from the world for a minute till he got dissed in a rap record. <laughs> like y'all need to start taking taking notes from that dude because he figured it out. He had he got the cheat code to to shutting women up. NDAs all over the place. One chick, he gave a hot sauce in the condom. Like he ain't playing around out here. And none of these, and none of these dudes figured none of this out. He was telling about like John Morant, where when the game was over, you know, families and friends are still allowed to stick around the arena. And how some of the guys uh were like some of his friends were shooting dice, like right on the NBA court. They was like shooting dice and the owners walked by and they just didn't even say nothing about it. They just overlooked it because it was, you know, they was looking like, who are them guys? Are they with John Morant? They just kept walking. Um, I, I don't know how true this is, you know, but if you do have a star player, I, can, I can't see some owners excusing certain behavior. They they just was. <laughs> yeah. no, I see that. I see yeah. that totally different. Now, you don't want to be seen as that person where everybody just look at you and just say typical Negro behavior. Like you do not want to be that person. He also plays in Memphis for the Memphis Grizzlies. Yeah. So Memphis is a whole other country. Yeah. I mean, look at look at John Moran. Do y'all really think that man? That man just he went out and did the same. As soon as they gave him that two hundred some million dollar contract, he went out and did the same thing. He about to get suspended for sixty games and still get paid. Like these dudes do not care. That's why they keep doing dumb shit. They know I'm paid anyway. That's the reason why you don't see as many NFL players get in trouble as NBA players. That shit ain't fully guaranteed over there. Guaranteed for sure. What's going on, Penny? What you got on it? You any thoughts? I don't really know this player. Oh, which one? The player that's talking about the overweight players. I really don't know his situation. (laughs) To speak on it, I don't know what he does, how good he He plays. Nothing, girl. Think about him, so I'm a Pelicans fan. He don't do nothing. I even know you could be in uh, in a league and still be in be overweight. I didn't even know that. I know you can play basketball not for long. Probably people not for need long. to start shaming these groupies that start outing these dudes. Like that shit ain't even cool. Like I agree with that. start going in on them. Like bitch, why you telling us? Like stay offline with that shit. You knew what it was already. Like we got. And stop I think it. a lot of people did. But, yeah, they post did. like that too. Like, why you're a porn star? We don't need to know. Why do you feel cheated on? Yeah, it's absolutely. But why are people so interested in that? People love drama. Right. So they're gonna get the reason why we was talking about young Miami a minute ago. Right. <laughs> and she did that. And she did that for Klaus. She know damn well he was messing with another chick. Like, come on now. No dude who who's trying to hide something goes out and publicly announces that his woman is pregnant. Like. If you trying to, if you really trying to hide what you're doing from this woman, you're gonna go out and, and make a public post that you know is gonna go viral the moment you say we're having a baby. I don't think he, he did. Was, I think it was, it was like her. Nine, five, two. She no, was a star, oh, he was the star Got mad that he got the other chick pregnant. That's what yeah. she was mad about. He's standing there smiling in the pictures with her and whatnot. Like that dude, she knew that that man had another woman on the side. Like, come on, man. I think everybody knew about everybody personally. So he was married? No, he just he just got another side, some other chick that he got pregnant. So he had two side chicks or two? He just, two, he two, just had two women that he was dealing with. Yeah, one being a porn star. Or corn star. Corn One was a Francisco. Re- she was retired. Sorry. A horn star. It's like that. <laughs> but honestly, these oh, these God. women that you guys are talking about, uh, there's guys that do tell them, like, hey, you know, this is what I'm going to do. Either you're going to stick with what I'm doing or you're not. It's just the thing is, you can't control how people react to things. So they might say, yeah, okay, yeah, that's cool. You know, because they're thinking about, oh, I'm about to get this money or whatever it is that excites them. And then when they get into it, they're like, oh, hell no, nah, uh-uh, that's mine. And then they become very possessive, and it's, it's a mm-hmm. whole other situation, and it's not what was signed up for. Um, and then with those groupies, I think what Vira was saying, they they tell groupies to stop, mm-hmm. chill the fuck out. The only difference is they don't tell them to stop coming around. So they like, you know, they'll, they'll t- calm down. You know, we ain't dealing with that shit, period. Mm-hmm. But then they 
keep doing it. So eventually you just got to remove them and, and keep it moving. But well, that's what he tried to do. He tried to tell her, hey, look, cool all that shit out. Why you, why you online doing all this dumb stuff? And she mm-hmm. blowing up the spot, talking about some we had bigger plans and all this. Like, man, no, you didn't. Stop lying. They got to tighten up with them NDAs, man. They, they out here falling asleep in the hotel with these bitches. Like, man, send them on their way when you're done. What the fuck is you sleeping with? Right. He knocked <laughs> out. And the only reason I, I saw that on the shade room when I was like. These dudes be good, but see. Hey, why are we going to sleep? sleep? <laughs> these dudes, these dudes. Why is she having to in the in, in a bed with several women, including herself, and posting it on? Why does she even have that? Right. Like, you, nope. should been, like, you should have been collecting phones um, before they came in, man. That's what, what I'm you, saying. You that's what's wrong. Have them have phones locked away. Because once you fall asleep, you're locked looking locked. for an opportunity to use them for it. He must have been pillow talking or something. Because one, why does he feel the need to have to do that? If he's so such a well, he's a basketball player. So why does he feel the need to do that? And she said they had plans. So that means that <laughs> he was pillow talking, telling her what they were going to do. Why does he feel the need to do that? And she got hurt because the baby's on the way. Like That's everybody, exactly. every mm-hmm. everybody needs to take a, a, a take notes out of Drake's book. You never seen that dude recorded on a video with sleep with like this dude had like some of y'all. We didn't know about his baby, this baby that he had been hiding from the world for a minute till he got dissed in a rap record. <laughs> like y'all need to start taking taking notes from that dude because he figured it out. He had he got the cheat code to to shutting women up. NDAs all over the place. One chick he gave a hot sauce and a condom. Like he ain't playing around out here. And none of these and none of these dudes figured none of this out. Uh, this lazy. Tiger this Woods baby. too. Tiger Woods is going through an, an agency for they said years. Damn. I didn't NBA's. know that. Still oh sick. yeah, it's all over the documentaries. <laughs> <laughs> they said his uh, his baby mama used to be uh, Drake. Baby mama was an escort. Exactly. He paid her to leave. <laughs> yeah, he blew. He definitely blew with that one. He paid her to get pregnant. Apparently, I, I, I got a question for the ladies, if, if that's okay. I'm just curious. What do women get out of going online and airing stuff out? Like, I'm like, what do they get from doing that? What do they believe is going to happen once they go public with they it? They got nothing else to lose. It's impulsive. I think <laughs> I, I, I think it's impulsive <laughs> because emotional, at the end of the, emotional. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's like it's, he can't hurt me no more than what he's hurting me now. So I'm about to air it all out. I'm about to hurt him. Like, do, do women like think like do they think it's like impulsive. after I post this? Like this is gonna be stupid. It's gonna make me look bad, and, and maybe make a man say, "I'm not gonna be with her." Because if she'll do that to this dude, like she'll definitely do that to me. Like, do women ever think about that? No, you know, no this not, 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 not a front. emotional response. Yeah, exactly. this is what makes me think that she actually is pregnant by him, because she wouldn't have did that if she had no leverage. That's why she was quiet. The very first thing she came out and said was, "You better hope that uh, I'm I'm late, and you better hope this baby ain't yours." Soon as she thought she had leverage, that's when she started airing all this dirty laundry out. Because she knew if she would have started saying this crap before she had what she thinks may be securing the bag. Because he was giving her thousands of dollars a month. So of course she had shut up. But Mom- look, she went, she went to social media because she had it was a last, last ditch effort to get her anger out to him because she lives in a different state. She talked about flying in and talked about being in New Orleans. And I'm sure he cut off all access when this other girl got pregnant and she started acting up. He cut all communication off. Her only way to let her see, I mean, let him see her anger was to go to social media and blow him up because she pro- he probably cut it all off when he told her, hey, this girl over here is pregnant. Like, this is what I'm doing. Da, 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 da. She lost her mind and he probably shut the dog on wall down in their relationship. He's like, okay, I got you. I'm going yeah. on social media. Are these younger women? They got it. No, them. she's actually older than him. They so old as hell. Is older. Okay. Old women doing it too. They're both they they both 30 plus years old. Like 20 something. Call me Casper, the friendly ghost. I'm ghosting. It's cool. <laughs> I take my L's just like I take my W's. I'm out of there. 
I don't understand it. It's and that's another thing. To answer um, your question. So, yeah, to answer Sir Hill's question too, like women don't like to take losses when it comes mm-hmm. to men. I don't know why. It's just like it's a part of life. Men take losses all the time when it comes to women. And so it, when it's flipped, it's like women don't want to be wrong. They don't want to look crazy. They don't want to be shamed. They don't, you know, where it's just like, it's just part of life. Just, just Girl, take that like country said, please. take your L and just keep it moving. But a lot of women go through this, um, this, I'm not going to deal with my stuff. And so I'll get a lifestyle that makes me forget about that, you know? And I don't, I, mm-hmm. it, it's there, but I don't really have to address it because I have this beautiful, I have this money coming in. I have this coming in. But at the end of the day, that stuff can be taken from you or it could be amplified in a way where you didn't deal with your stuff and now you got more stuff added on top of the stuff you didn't already deal with. 